All right, let's circle back to more news. Tonight, the Siaya County Deputy Governor William Odual can breathe a sigh of relief after the Senate overturned his impeachment that sought to remove him from office for gross violation of the Constitution, among other allegations. Now, the Senate vowed to overturn the report of an 11 member Senate special committee that uh, recommended the removal of the Deputy Governor after two out of five grounds uh, were sustained or substantiated as KTN's political. Affairs reporter Emmanuel To now explains Odwal has promised to mend fences with his boss, CIA Governor James Orengo, as the MCAs vowed to deal with him politically. The Deputy Governor of Sierra County, William Odwal, held his breath for about five hours. And after a back and forth between the opposers and supporters of his impeachment, 43 senators who took the vote on the two main counts leveled against him had their way. The eyes. 16, nays 27, abstention 0. So the nays have it. I'm uh, extremely excited and uh, first I want to thank God yeah. for uh, this uh, victory and uh, importantly I equally want to thank the Senate uh, for uh, the very fair impartial deliberations that I have had at the Senate and um, I want to assure the people of Sierra that our primary calling is service to them. The elated deputy governor promising to mend fences with his boss, uh, Governor James Orengo. We've never had uh, personal differences with uh, Governor Orengo. Our differences have always been around governance. It's ideological. And uh, with this now behind us, I believe that uh, we will have a working formula. I, I want to use both them uh, um, in person, and I also hope to use elders to, and churches to, to help us, uh, you know, uh, bridge this divide. On their part, the MCAs who claim political witch hunt from the senators, a majority from Kenya Kwanzaa, promised to deal with the DG politically. We have confirmed, we have been vindicated here, that there is a, con a, a breakage of law. There is uh, the, the deputy gov uh, governor uh, has, has uh, bro uh, broken uh, or contravened the constitution. So, them working with Orengo, is it going to rectify the constitutional breach? The special committee of the Senate found the deputy governor to be culpable. What has played out in the Senate in the, in the debate which was going on was the political game between Azimio and Kenya Kwanzaa. And it's good, we now know we are, we as here is an ODM government. The 11 member special senate committee recommended the removal of a duel, finding him at fault on two out of the five allegations leveled against him on gross violation of the constitution and misinformation. After according the Honorable William Odwal, the deputy governor of Siaya, an opportunity to be had resolves to impeach Honorable William Odwal, the deputy governor of Siaya county government on the following charges. The report drew battle lines in the sun between the Kenya Kwanzaa senators and the Azimilo Moja one Kenya legislators as the government senators went all out in defense of the besieged deputy governor. Mr. Speaker, you saw our troops in the National Assembly of Kenya Kwanzaa during the finance bill. The, wife we, the, the same knife we use at the National Assembly, Mr. Speaker, is we shall use to fanguish and ensure we incinerate anybody who would want to allow the corruption to be sanitized, Mr. Speaker. He report to Yungi Mkono, na tukubaliana ya kwamba furushu wa mulakani, atoki kwenye hali mamlaka ya naibu wa ugavana. Emmanuel Chow, KT News, Nairobi. In other news, Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa.